Hey, 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 it's me, Meatbag McMurker, Pirate Party candidate for governor in Utah. And today I want to I want to do a Switch review for a game called Dead Cells. Dead Cells is available on uh, it's available on download and it, and it's also I saw it at the uh, at, at a number of uh, video game stores. It's it's a really good game. I think this is my favorite game I've played for the Switch so far. Um, I'm still waiting for Super Smash Brothers to come out, but until then, um, all right. So Dead Cells, I'm not sure. Yeah, you can't really get a good good thing. They got got a lot of reflection off this screen, but uh, Dead Cells, great game. Um, it's very 8-bit, very 16-bit. You can see uh, footage of it online. I because of the, the the Nintendo Creator program or whatever it is, I, I can't actually like play any gameplay footage. Uh, otherwise, I'll lose all the zero dollars that uh, that I'm gonna make off of this video. So, Dead Cells is a game uh, where you start off at level zero. Every time you die, you go back to level zero. Um, so you can get to like level 10 and then when you die you have to restart at level 0. But the beauty of this game <coughs> is that as you're making your way through stages, when you get to the end of, the, end of your stage you've got these things called cells that you've, that you've accumulated and you can use those cells to buy power-ups to basically help you survive a little bit longer. You can buy additional weapons. Um, so your objective is always to make it to the end of the stage so you can cash in those cells for power-ups. And, and over time, the power-ups become more and more and more expensive. But every time you play, you seem to be able to get just a little bit further sometimes. Sometimes you, uh, you have a, and, and sometimes you have a run where it just, things just don't go right. You don't get the right weapons. Um, now my personal opinion is, is that, is that, uh, this game, uh, is really cool in the sense that it has a build system where you can sort of design your character to act the way you want to act um, uh, in terms of, you know, if you want just brutal brute force, you can build a character based around that. And every time you start, it resets. So you, so you have to start with like a brand new build. You have to use the, the tools and the items that are provided to you for, you know, skill purposes and advance and, and, and keep pushing on. You got traps and abilities and stuff like that that are really cool. Grenades and uh, it's an amazing game. Very like uh, it reminds me a lot of uh, uh, well, it's a Metroidvania style style game. So you go up and down, you go left and right, and the gameplay style is very similar to both those games. Uh, it's a lot of fun, a lot of fun. I'd highly recommend it. On a scale of one to ten, I would give it uh, about a nine. This has been Meatbag with Verka, Pirate Party candidate for Governor in Utah, with your short Nintendo Switch game review. Thank you.